Starbucks is secured. Now we gotta go to Walmart. Okay, you guys, we're parked at the Walmart. I just cleaned my truck really fast, but I'm about to go inside and get groceries and other stuff that I need. I yet again do not have a grocery list, so we are just going with the vibes again. So, yeah. Where at, where am I? I'm in Michigan. I honestly don't remember the city that I'm in, but I'm waiting on a load right now. I went and dropped an empty and it still wasn't ready, you guys. And I was about to pull up at like midnight last night. So thank God I didn't and I slept because it would have been all for nothing. But we got our Starbucks earlier, which you guys saw in the vlog already. But yeah. You guys literally, look at what I just did. Fucking stupid. story of my life you guys I don't even get how I did that like how stupid can you be to forget that you put a coffee on your cart shoes <sighs> this is what I'm getting we're gonna meal prep some stuff and then I got like this electric grill and it's on sale right now at Walmart for $20 and it was $35 so yeah then I got stuff to make smoothies I got yogurt I got like rice to meal prep with we got new meal prep containers because I threw away a lot of them and then salmon and fajita meat and tortillas for the fajitas and yeah I feel like that's it I think I needed a lot more but I'm not remembering anything that I need everything together and JBS just called me just now so it was like perfect timing they just called me saying that my load is ready to go pick up so I'm headed back over there to go pick up the load and then we are going to Rochester New York and then New Jersey I don't remember what part of New Jersey we're going to so it's a two-stop load I'm about to do laundry because look at how much laundry I have to do. So I'm gonna start laundry. I need to meal prep and I need to shower. So Ohio 
Ohio still. It's the next day. I stopped at a service plaza because they have Starbucks. And clearly, I'm gonna stop at their Starbucks. But there's also Panera and Auntie Anne's and a lot of other things. So it's giving I might stop at every restaurant in here. Or not restaurant, but every place in here and get something to eat because. Showers in here. They got massage chairs. They got some. <gasps> Should we play the lottery, you guys? I don't know if you already need a lottery ticket. They got more massage chairs. Yeah. <gasps> These showers are actually not that bad. Like it's not. Oh, there's piss in the. Oh, okay. Y'all truckers, see this is why we can't have shit. Y'all, y'all just be disrespectful. But it's really not that bad, you guys. Like look at the. Look, it's giving nice. They got a laundry room. I should have done my laundry here. It's cleaner than the, the damn truck stops. Look, wow, that's actually surprising. Look at them. I mean, this one's soaked, but it's okay. It's still nice. Okay, Ohio. I got a community meeting. Okay. Now I'm about to just get Starbucks really fast. We have like five hours until I get to New York, so we're doing okay. What timing today? Even though, like, I took a long ass break because I did all of my laundry yesterday. What did I do there? I didn't meal prep yet, so we're gonna have to meal prep when I get into New York. But I'm about to get Starbucks. swipe and look at all the hair that is from you that is from you oh my god y'all yeah okay so we need to vacuum we need to vacuum we need to get i just feel like i'm so not put together right now and i just don't know i don't know like i don't like this feeling at all i don't know what i'm going through i don't know why i haven't been able to be like sleeping good i really have not been able to sleep like a full good like seven to eight hours and i just don't know what is going on with me but it's all good we're gonna i feel like i'll feel better once i fold this laundry and meal prep and everything so let me just show you guys what i am going to be meal prepping because honestly i don't even know what i'm going to be meal prepping so it's gonna be a surprise to you and me because yeah let's just get into it i've been obsessed with propel waters I used to love getting these and then I like stopped getting them and then I remember the other day like oh my god I like Propel. Is it just me or like do you guys go to the grocery store and you don't even know what you want to buy anymore? Because like I literally don't even know what I like eating anymore. I don't know what. I don't know. It's so weird. I have no clue about anything lately. I'm just like out here doing what I do I guess. Okay so get back get back get back get back just because of the fact that i don't feel like like asparagus takes a while to cook so yeah it's 
not something I'm trying to do. All right. Um, I have ground turkey that I still need to make. I have, let's see. What is this? Oh, this is palm spoon. Okay, so honestly, you guys, this is like the salmon and stuff in here. This is gonna have to wait because not in the mood. And I also have ground turkey that I was gonna do some tacos with, so I might just pick up that meat as well. Shut up, Tom, back up. Seriously, stop. Okay, so, okay, yeah, so I think I'm just gonna cook the meat, because look, I got um, fajita seasoning, and then I got like the, um, what's it called? The tortillas to put the fajita meat into, and then I'm gonna have like pico de gallo, guacamole, sour cream, lettuce, all that in the things when I choose to like eat it or whatever, but I just wanna cook it, that way it doesn't go bad. And then, um, if you guys get grossed out like when dogs are like near your food and stuff, don't watch me because baby, this dog, like there's no going around it. Like he's too nosy, I'm, yeah. So this is just the salmon. Um, I get the one without the skin on the back because I don't like, like I don't like cooking it with the skin and I don't like tearing the skin off, it grosses me out. So yeah, I got the one without the skin and I need to season it cook it all of that um i usually like i like eating chicken versus like red meat like that fajita meat but in the truck i never feel right making chicken unless it's like pre-washed and everything um sometimes i will get it if like i can go inside and wash it but uh yeah i just it's not giving what it needs to give I'll sometimes like I'll just put it in a bowl with vinegar and that washes it but it still doesn't feel right to me so that is why I never really cook chicken in here unless like I have a kitchen sink or something because maybe I'm not washing it in a bathroom sink no ma'am but yeah I'm about to get cooking kibbles his kibbles are always out but he's like the type of dog that doesn't even enjoy kibbles hold on let me pause this YouTube he's the type of dog that doesn't even enjoy kibbles so he is on our Acana dog food now A-C-A-N-A -A. and 
I got like he does the wet food of it too but it's not really wet food because it's like whole pieces of lamb with like vegetables and stuff in it he also likes the duck one so I've been giving him this sometimes and then um he also gets the uh what is it called damn what is it it's beef and venison or something it's like beef and bison or I don't know y'all it's something with more vegetables put in and literally when I tell y'all this is the only thing he will sit down and like eat all of it in one sitting because he doesn't really like kibbles like that I don't know what it is but yeah my salmon is cooking I'm about to flip it and see what it's looking like and I might open up the grill that I bought um I just don't really feel like cleaning that tonight because this, I'm just honestly going to wipe it out until I get the chance to clean it. Because I don't think I'm going to bring it inside to clean it. Because I'm getting tired, even though I just was not tired. But yeah, let's finish my flipping. Yeah, we definitely are not going to make those burgers tonight. Because not in the mood. But we have everything all meal prepped. And so basically, this is just the salmons with broccoli and cheese rice. And then this is just the steak for the fajitas. I didn't do any of the vegetables, you guys. So I didn't do the asparagus that's going to go with the salmon. And then I didn't do the onions and peppers that's going to go in with the fajitas. And I didn't... Um, what else did I do? Oh, the fajitas just have guacamole and pico on the side that's in the fridge. And then the rice I'm going to put in the fajita when I heat them up.
guys, so I'm at my first stop here in Rochester, New York. Clearly, I did not get ready last night because I'm still wearing the same thing. I ended up like taking a little cat nap of like two hours. Waking up and then just literally going inside, brushing my teeth, getting Dunkin' Donuts. I got a hot blueberry coffee because it is 40 degrees. Yeah, I'm about to walk Palm, drink my coffee, chill for a little bit. I am going to get changed and get a little, you know, ready for my day, I guess, as much as I can. Because I was not expecting to take that cat nap, you guys. Like, I literally wanted to leave there at, like, 